FTXers, we are in our last week of the Open. This is going to be week three, day three for the workout. Uh, you're going to start with this, on this workout, you're starting with 10 reps and you're descending all the way to one. So each movement, you're going to do 10 reps of each, then you go to nine, then eight, then seven, and so on. You have dumbbells, shoulder to overheads. The weights are different for ARCs and ARCs plus, so it largely depends on what you have at home, or if you need to come and borrow some weights from us so you can have two dumbbells to do that. 30s for men, 20s for ladies at RX, 45s for men, 30s for ladies at RX plus. And then ring rows for RX, or you can do a green banded pull up if you have a pull up bar. Uh, if you don't, just try to get those uh, rings as low as you can for your pulling motion. For the warm up, we're going to do three rounds, 20 shoulder taps, 10 push ups to down dog, and then 10 bent over rows on each arm. So I'm going to go through from top to bottom each movement. So in the workout, dumbbell shoulder to overhead. You're going to have both dumbbells, just come up to the shoulders here, and you're going shoulder to overhead so it can be a dip and drive, or if you feel like you can just press it out over and over again, no big deal. If it's pretty heavy, but you want to try it anyway, then you can uh, do a, a jerk. So push and drop underneath. That way you can lift a little bit more weight there, but that will get very taxing very fast. And then of course, your next movement is going to be the ring rows. So make sure that whenever you're pulling, especially like if you're at uh, the kitchen table, you're pulling all the way to where the chest hits either the rings or the kitchen table. The kitchen table usually uh, will be a little further away than the rings, but either way, try to make contact with the body. For the warm-up movements, your shoulder taps are just in a plank position. Okay, so try not to have the hips too high or low, and as you do your shoulder taps, each one is a rep. So one, two, three, four, and so on. Then from there, you're going to go right into push-ups into a down dog. So here, make sure you make contact with the ground. Come up, extend the elbows, then push back into your down dog. On that down dog, you're trying to get your armpits towards your toes. You'll feel a stretch in your calves and hamstrings. And then you have bent over rows. Any style with the dumbbell, you can go with a lawnmower row leaning on your knee. Make sure you pull back, making contact with the body. You can also match up those feet, same thing, make contact with the body there. All right, good luck with this workout.